You are welcome to Understanding Mathematics with Kemi. Today we'll be talking about addition. Addition of numbers like 1 plus 3 uh, is equal to 4. Addition of numbers in the range of let's say 20 plus 14 and also numbers like 99 plus 73 okay by the time we are through with this video tutorial on addition you will find addition a thing of fun in fact, you begin to ask, uh, give me any number that falls within this number. I will do it for you in seconds. Okay? So, we're going to be focus our addition on units, um, then also tens, tens. and hundreds hundreds okay so these are the basics what is units or what are units okay units and numbers and additions like adding up numbers like single numbers like one plus three this is addition in units okay so addition in units we begin to see add numbers like one two three four five six seven eight and nine then addition in tens this is an example of addition in 10 20 plus 14 then you begin to see numbers like 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 then 19 Addition in hundreds, as the name implies, hundred, then two hundred, on and on, three hundred, four hundred, five hundred, six hundred, seven hundred, eight hundred, and nine hundred. There are various methods of doing additions like this in mathematics, but we are going to focus on a single method which I find it fun to use in adding up number and it is very fast, it is very effective. You don't need to memorize how to add up any number. All you just need to know is to understand the basics of how to use the counting board. Okay? So we're going to use the counting board in adding up our numbers. Okay, what does it count in numbers? The counting board using the counting board is using or counting numbers in adding up numbers in column we we'll start from the right the u stands for unit The T 
stands for the tense while H represents hundreds okay so I'm going to show you how to use the counting board to add up numbers that falls between units tens hundreds okay so we're going to do that just now let's start with the basic okay let's start with adding up um, simple numbers in units like let's say 2 plus 3 okay well we're gonna use um gonna use balls to to add we we'll put it on the counting board so when we talk of two we're gonna add two balls to the unit column okay that is one ball okay two ball so we're gonna add this three ball in still under the unit ball unit column we're gonna put it down towards down I'm gonna put it down as one as two and as three so now we count one two three four five we have five balls two two plus three equals five you see what I mean it's so easy you know just placing some balls in the column you get you add everything up it becomes five okay let's try another example it's very easy like I told you you begin to do additions in seconds addition in seconds okay let's drop another column another counting board okay always uh, when you use the counting board you can always draw three columns at times they are in they are more than three because when you're doing addition in thousands but one just want to focus addition for now in hundred tens and units so if it's going to extend to thousand you keep on drawing more columns to the left okay so let's do this addition let's add up let's see three plus five okay three plus five now let's place the the balls let's place the balls okay the first ball first three ball goes in one two and three okay remaining five balls is going to be down one two three four and five okay so we're going to count the total ball in the column you know count the total ball in the column okay let's count one two three four five six seven and eight so you see three plus five gives you eight so fast and so easy with this basic understanding you can add up any number like I said before between the range of 1 to 9 any number at all you can between this range you can do it in this unit column very easy very easy you know